Hello everybody, V here, and that is way loud. Um, welcome back. And today I'm going to be playing uh, Dead Space 3. I on, I've uh, played it before. I've beaten it before, not too long ago. But I honestly love it, and I need to turn this way down because it's way too loud for me. Where is it? And. Let's turn it down to 50. Same here. I got subtitles on. So. I have played and have beaten Dead Space 2. I've never played Dead Space 1. But that really won't matter. Um. And we're good to go. So, anyways, I played the second Dead Space. Absolutely loved it. I played Dead Space 3, I'm still working on beating Classic, haven't played it in a while, but this is a brand new game, I'm starting from scratch, I do have all, like, I, I got the special edition, so I have all the other weapons and stuff, and the scavenger bot upgrades, um, I don't know, I really don't feel like dying a lot, you know, I just want to play, and, you know what, I'm just going to shut up. of limitless energy until it produced dementia, insanity, and a twisted life after death known as necromorphs. The details of the original black market disaster were buried in cover-ups and conspiracies, but not before an entire religion could be launched in the name of one of its researchers, Michael Altman. His questionable death turned him into a martyr, and a unitology was born. To this day, it thrives. A secretive organization that believes the Markers are divine. And their plan for us, a glorious unity of mind, body, and spirit. Generations after the Black Marker disaster, mankind found himself going extinct from lack of resources. Desperate, he sought to replicate the Black Marker in an attempt to harness its limitless energies for himself. The records of this era are unclear, but we now know the replication was successful, but the cost too high. The marker copies were all buried, hidden in secret places across the universe where, to all our benefit, they might have stayed. But 200 years later, during an illegal mining operation on Aegis 7, the planet cracker USG Ishimura unearthed one of the forgotten copies, a red marker, and with it, the start of a new wave of marker infections. A key survivor of that incident was an engineer named Isaac Clark. That marker spoke to him and left him with a gift, a mental blueprint of the marker itself. Isaac was captured and tortured by Earthgo, his mind harvested for the marker's secrets. The marker program was thus restarted, and a new one built on the populous Titan Sprawl. The disaster quickly followed. He managed to escape, but just barely. There was nothing left but dust, just like Aegis Seven. Since that time, the marker crisis has only deepened, and Isaac Clarke, his marker touch mind still burning with the ability to build or destroy them stays in hiding, determined to retreat from the markers and all they have wrought. But there is hope. A backwater ice ball of a planet where 200 years ago, someone somehow stopped a marker uprising in its tracks. A clue from the past that may save our future. Well, that was a neat little history lesson for you there. Um, Alright. So, there's like one more cut scene, and then I can jump back into it. I don't want to cut all this out, because it's, it's like really important to the story. It really is. Um, 
I know a lot of people didn't like this game because it felt too open. It really took away from the close quarters horror feel of the first two. But honestly, I don't think that because there's still a lot of areas where you're in close quarters and it's still very terrifying. You never know what's going to come out of where and when. It's, it's still a pretty decent experience. What I will say, though, is that the amount of enemies that come at you are... It's too much. There's a bunch... A bunch of enemies will come at you at once and try and swarm you, but they're fairly easy to take down if you know what you're doing. It's just, it's, it does feel a little action oriented. Alpha Niner, this is Whiskey 250. Serrano, do you read me? Oh, thank God. Did you find it? Find it. Doc, I'm not even sure what we're looking for. Alright, let's get into it, and, yeah, there we go, wait, where, wait, where, oh, there we go. Alright, still going the right way, I guess. Yeah, I'm still going the right way. Just checking. Wow. We're sprinting all the way. Whoops. Trying to remember all the controls here. I beat it, and once I complete this, I'm probably—I don't know. Yeah, once I beat this, I'm gonna go ahead and play the um, the DLC for it. I never actually got to complete that. Uh. Oh God! Still coming. Uh, uh. I. You too. Okay. That was uncalled for. You're looking for a cylinder, about half a meter long. Do you see it? Did I get everything? I guess I did. Where is he? When there. Nah. Yeah, I'm pretty sure there was a dead body there. Any more surprises? Yep, I guess so. Alright. <gasps> Go, cheese! Holy crap, that made me... Holy crap, that... Oh my god. That one... That was sneaky. Alright, that was... Screw you. Yup, oh, yep, that was entirely original. Alright, where are you? Yeah, they're not here. That was sneaky. That that one made me jump. Man, that was I'm gonna hang on to Thunder, Tim. Yeah, 
Yeah, uh... Oh, shift. Uh, come on, come on. Oh, boy. Come on, get over here. Yeah, come on, come on. We're almost there. We're almost there, Tim. You're doing great, Tim. Ow. Oh no. Oh no. Run. Uh. Okay. Oh wow, that was close. Uh. And are we good? All right. You're fine. I'm sure it's just a minor concussion. Maybe a few broken bones. You know, you might be a little fucked up, actually. Yep. He's dead. They're dead. And that would be? You know, I never really realized what side this guy's on. Is he a unitologist or is he... And... Boom. Data purged. All right. Well, how about that? Brothers and sisters, the age of man make us whole. Oh no, Ellie! No! <gasps> Jump scare! But not really. Classic plasma cutter. He knows what's up.
That was interesting. Alright, so... I'm gonna cut it off here, guys. If you enjoyed, please remember to leave a rating and uh, consider subscribing. And until then, this has been V, and I'm out.